Hey girlfriends, welcome back to the channel for another video. If you're new here, my name is Jerry Nicomicea, but all my friends call me G. And hopefully you will want to be a friend that can call me G, okay? In order to call me G, girl, you have to subscribe, okay? And become a girlfriend. Ooh, y'all. Girl, I got some tea for y'all. Oh my God, y'all. My life right now, I feel like I can't keep up. Oh baby, oh baby. So... As you guys can see, this is like a little Mardi Gras vlog. It may be short. I don't know what y'all gonna get. <sighs> this is my first year actually attending parades and stuff for the longest. My family, they do it every year, baby. They be like, Jerry, can you come? And I'm like, no, mm -mm, I'm at home. I don't go to parades. I just don't want to do it. So this year I was like, girl, why not? I don't work my job no more. My energy is mine. I'm well rested. That's how I feel. Oh my God, y'all. I don't know what's happening. Between Mardi Gras season taking over the city, not only the city, my life. I'm actually, I just finished recording a video because I actually have somewhere to be. Like I need to be like leaving the house right now. Tomorrow is Lunday Gras. And I have something to do for that. Then I'm going to parades all day for Mardi Gras. Girl, I'm tired. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. I'm tired, your girl. Baby, I'm like, oh. Can I take this one off because I'm tired, okay? <sighs> Me and my wig can't take it, girl. But in this vlog, I'm going to take you guys to do as much as I can, y'all. I'm over here. I'm doing 14 Days of Love. Baby, I'm doing Mardi Gras. I'm doing this other things outside of my little world on YouTube. Because y'all know I have a whole life. I think sometimes people don't realize I have a whole life outside of what you guys see you guys see this much of my life sometimes you'll see this much y'all i have a whole life outside of youtube and i feel like right now everything is just like clashing not clashing but colliding that's a better way to say colliding girl i cannot wait to wednesday when this is all over oh valentine's day hopefully you guys watch um 14 days of love part one in part two right now i'm working on part two also while i'm vlogging this vlog y'all i'm going back and forth so i know part two gonna be good because baby i need some loving on me okay because girl i need a nap okay that right there alone is an act of love i need a nap y'all shout out to all the people who came to new orleans if i met you hey girl hey but yeah y'all you guys are gonna be in this with me. Now the real task is this. We, I need to sit down and talk to y'all and do this. I wanna order, if I, if I can't order it, we need to go out to the store to find it. I want like a Mardi Gras headband. I want, I really want a purple wig because I've been seeing all of the girlies at the parades with like the purple wigs. I wanted to get like eye designs. I wanna go all out. I don't care if I look tacky. I wanna go all out and just have fun. So that's that's on my um my list of things. This is my first time picking up the camera to actually talk to y'all. So let's just rewind back to last night. Last night we went to Endymion. Endymion is such a beautiful parade. It was long as hell, but I really had fun. I think I had fun because I didn't just sit down. Me, my sister, and other people, everybody actually was catching stuff. Like we actually went over there to like be at the parade and catch stuff. Girl, we don't usually do that. That's like that's that's not the vibe that we go to the parade and do we'd be sitting down chilling drinking all of the things but i actually was trying to catch stuff so i caught two things y'all two i was very disappointed i said oh no baby we gotta do better so let's just rewind back to last night and then once y'all caught up with that we'll just catch up to current day so let go <laughs> Oh, 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 
Hey girlfriends, happy Monday, girl. Yeah, I'm about to leave the house. I'm trying to make sure I don't leave anything dirty because I hate coming back to a dirty house. Um, let me show y'all what I got on. I got on something very simple. I'm not wearing makeup today. I'm not in the mood. So let me show y'all what I'm wearing. So I have on this two-piece set from Nasty Gal. These socks. I'm gonna put on my Yeezy Wave Runners. I have on this denim trench from Zara. My Fendi mama baguette and i just did it crossbody so i can put all of my things in there my sunglasses are fendi and i just put my hair in a claw clip and for the skin we just have on sunscreen and lip gloss so this is the vibe for the day and i'll see you guys once i leave um right now i'm about to go meet up with i think just my grandma and stephanie i don't know who else is coming with us it was storming outside y'all but right now it is so beautiful so as soon as i opened the door and i thought it was nice i said oh, i'm ready to go i'm not in the mood to do makeup so that's why i did not do makeup last night i just did like a fresh facial i did an exfoliation all of the things so the skin is skinning and as long as you got on your sunscreen and your lip gloss is popping girl you good oh. I left my grandma and Steph to go to Double Tree to get cookies. Baby, Double Tree have the best cookies, okay? Now I'm back to the festivities. My wine is empty, but I do have a full bottle in the car, so we're good. So we stopped to get a, a funnel cake, and my sugar mama got me a funnel cake. No, she did not. Thank you. Yeah. I need my money. Steph brought us a funnel cake. I need my money. Mm -hmm. Are you would not. Stevie, get a beat. Yes. Definitely, I'll take you to a concert. Okay, you wanted to. I didn't want to buy the food. <laughs> Stephanie, I don't if want to do you this. don't let me eat this funnel cake, you would never get nothing. So you're not sending your money? So you want five, you want to find five yes, dollars? I mean, five dollars. Yes, five. You have five dollars. Do you have it to give me? I don't. Well, you got a funnel cake. Stephanie. You need to order your cake. So I need to, I need to order my order cake. the cake. You don't uh, give me my money. Guys, Stephanie would never get shit else from me. Nothing. Do I want a full funnel cake? No, you don't. And I'm not giving you five dollars. Well, you need a full funnel cake. You got ten to spend. I don't have a job. Well, me, well. I don't have five dollars. You recording? <laughs> Are you ordering a funnel cake? Uh, twenty dollars. You wanna be? So she got, she got money. You want to change the party? <laughs> okay. Why y'all got one? Yeah. Well, she got one, but she don't want to share. Oh. Yeah, I need Why my money. Why did you buy two? She got five, oh, she got five, five girl. Yeah, I'm sorry. That's so nosy. Where's our cake? They're baking it, frying it. But she ain't telling them extra about it. And what do you tell them about our? Our, me and you. The girls can't even let you hold ten dollars, girl. For my, I don't have ten dollars. You said when you get home, I said, I said, girl, can I have ten dollars? I said, can I borrow? It is 5.46 a.m. <laughs> and I'm over here like, do I really want to go to a parade, y'all? Do I care that much to go? Because, oh my God, like, baby. <laughs> I went to sleep at 3 a.m. It is 5.45. Oh. All right, y'all, so I'm headed out. It is 7.13 and I just have on my heat tech from Unicool, which it's gonna keep me warm because it's 40. Yeah, I'm tired. 40 something degrees outside. A Balenciaga scarf, Balenciaga city bag, a beanie from Gap. Um, and I just put on my Yeezy Wave Runners again. Yes, I'm wearing shoes in the house because I did not mop. So I'm gonna mop uh, probably tomorrow. But let's go, girl. I'll see you outside. Grandma should be pulling up any minute now. So. Let's go. All right, y'all, so I made it to the parade, raw girl. I got my chair, and we ready for the vibes. At a parade, baby, you need you a seat, okay? Now my mission is to find food, because your girl is home. So I waiting for Stell to go help me find food. Girl, you waiting, we gonna find food.
girl so i am back home y'all mardi gras is officially over i am happy this is over okay girl first of all i got home maybe 20 minutes yeah about 20 minutes i made it home at 4 p.m my family is still out going okay i'm talking about they they, they partying baby i said take me home okay y'all my cousin got so tall he ended up in the hospital the girls they're just they're going too hard for me okay i'm like baby i'm tapping out i had enough y'all i've been up since 3 a.m i had to be up at 5 i ended up getting up at like 5 45 but i was up since 3 girl i'm about to go to sleep i didn't take a melatonin at 4 p.m i'm about to go to sleep I, I, i'm done now let me tell y'all i am pissed so the weather everything was so beautiful today i don't know if y'all could tell I have a freaking suntan on my face. For those of you who know me, y'all know I don't play when it comes to my skin. I'm not like the skin on my, not skin, sun directly on my face. One thing about me, girl, I'm going to hide from the sun. I'm going to put on a hat. I do not like direct sunlight on my face. Just like, like that. Y'all, I didn't wear makeup today. Did have on sunscreen. Why I fell asleep outside in a chair mouth open on the parade route girl with my blanket cuddled up and i had on my sunglasses so i don't know if y'all could see it it's like a suntan oh my god so i came home girl i just did skincare it's a little burnt but not that much this right here is perfect for this um the calendula deep cleansing foaming wash and the toner from kills that's what i used and to cool it off, I use the Peter Thomas Roth Cucumber Gel Mask. Anytime I'm in the sun for a long time, like if I'm at a pool or something, I reach for this. This is like my go-to cooling mask for that. But, girl, I'm not happy about this. So, I'm about to moisturize y'all. And I'm going to see y'all later. I know this is not going to end up being a full Mardi Gras vlog. Because, girl, I ain't do... All right, please let it be money. I I ain't do um I didn't do everything, baby. I'm tapping out now. I see why I never go to pearls and stuff. It's just too much. Don't get me wrong, it's fun, but you have to be. I'm talking about energized, and I just feel like I've been having so much going on, girl. I just feel like I just need to go to sleep. So we're gonna just continue to vlog, and you guys are just gonna come with me i'm still also doing 14 days of love tomorrow is valentine's day and i'm so excited for that like baby i am ready okay so oh, and i'm also about to spray some rose water this is my favorite rose water by mario badescu and i keep this one in the fridge because spraying it on my face when it's cold y'all top tier experience Now I really look like a glazed donut, but I'm telling y'all, this combo right here, the Kiehl's Ultra Facial Cream, Hydrating Cream, this is the best, like I don't care what nobody say, when it comes to a hydrating moisturizer, I have used this thing like for years, but I've also tried so many different brands, y'all, this is the only thing that really gives me like a deep hydration, like I love this stuff, I constantly purchase it, um, but mixing the two this combo thank me later okay so, so let's just hope we can nourish my skin back to health because girl we can't we can't play ourselves like that hey girlfriends it is a new day i am in the process of cleaning my house i'm doing like a reset i did not record that because girl ain't nothing to see i'm just washing my bedding um i mopped I did like a deep, a deep clean because for the past two weeks I have been all over the place and today I did a reset. So I have been, I don't know where to put y'all. I don't feel like holding y'all. Hold on. So you guys know I did a video on these handbags from TJ Maxx and I put you girls on the dupes for these bags. And when I tell y'all, I, I don't care what nobody say. You can love the anthropology bag. You can love your Amazon dupes. You can love the Etsy dupes. These dupes for $30, y'all, this is the best Bottega dupe I have come across. 
it's the price for me okay you can't even beat this thing with a stick the quality everything on this bag is amazing so I did a video on this bag and one of the girlfriends was like hey gee they have other colors did you not see the pink and the lilac purple <sighs> girlfriend now I'll just do that to me because I was like well, wait a minute so I went searching the internet to see what color the bag is y'all this bag is so pretty now the thing is this it's like this salmon pink peachy color oh my god it is gorgeous so I went to every single TJ Maxx and Marshalls in New Orleans, y'all. I'm talking about, I was, I went everywhere, girl. If you live in New Orleans, you know how far I had to drive. I was on the West Bank. I went to Elmwood. I went to Veterans. Girl, I dang near went to Slidell, okay? I could not find this bag. So I was like, you know what? That's why I have a community of girlfriends and I'm about to <laughs> put a PSA out. So I made a post in my communities here saying how I really wanted this bag. I need somebody to help me. So two of the girlfriends said that they found this bag for me. And in my head, I'm like, Jeronica, what if you get scammed? In my head, I'm like, girl, I'd rather really take a risk. What I'm gonna get, uh, the bag is $30. 30 yeah $30 shipping what $10 I'm gonna get scanned for $40 I'll take a risk okay I want the bag so two girlfriends said they found the bag one of the girlfriends said she shipped the bag I'm trying to pay her her money back I'm like girl what is your PayPal can I have the tracking you know I'm trying to give you your money because I don't want you to think I'm scamming you because she said she already shipped the bag. She's not responding. Girlfriend, where are you? <laughs> I'm trying to give you your money, girl. I don't want, look, G scam somebody. Uh-uh. Take your $40, sis. So she haven't uh, responded back. So I'm like, oh my God, please don't let this be a scam. Girl, I have went through a rabbit hole to see if this is a scam. I found a person on Instagram. I'm like, wait, this person even to follow me on Instagram. I'm like, oh, is this a scam? So one of the girlfriends, y'all, she just uh, DM'd me and she said she found the bag. She's like, gee, I got you one and I got me one. Do you want me to send it to you? I said, girl, hold that bag because if I don't hear from the other girlfriend by tomorrow, I'm going to buy the bag from the second girlfriend. So I went to stalk her to see if she have like a social footprint. She has a footprint, y'all. She followed me and she, she's a real person. <laughs> so... Crossing fingers that I can get this bag, y'all. I want this bag so bad because I want the bag in peach because I, it's like a peachy pink. I'm not paying designer prices for a pink bag because I don't wear pink enough, but I do need a pink bag in my wardrobe. So I feel like this would be the perfect way to get um a pink bag that I would actually wear without paying designer prices. So I really want this bag in that pink color. Now, I started this thread, y'all, yesterday. There's almost like 80 five comments on this thread now because everybody's helping each other look for the bag so one of the girlfriends live in Houston one of them live in Dallas so what I'm gonna do since the girlfriends helped me find the bag I want to pay it forward so what I'm about to do is I'm about to leave my house and go to my local stores and I'm gonna try to pick up as many bags well the ones that the girl said that they want they want a green one girl want a green one girl want a black hobo tote which i saw both of these yesterday so what i'm about to do is go pick these up and see if i can get these bags to the girlfriends because i want to pay it forward because i didn't start something with this mess now y'all i'm sorry i just was trying to put the girls on i didn't know y'all was gonna actually go on the hunt to multiple stores like G sent me here to look for this bag okay I apologize so since I started some bullshit let me help um pay it forward so since a girlfriend helped me I'm about to go out and help some other girlfriends so that's my goal y'all I'm about to take a break to do this and I'm gonna take you guys with me I look a mess and whatever y'all it is legit raining out here I said, girl, when it comes to the girlfriends, oh, they got a Barnes and Nobles over here, girl, where have I been? But when it comes to the girlfriends, y'all can never say, gee, don't love y'all, okay? I said, girl, the things we do for fashion, it is legit raining out here, and I got no slides. Y'all, I hate getting my toes wet. I hate getting my toes wet in the rain, and I just missed a damn parking spot. I'm crossing fingers, girlfriend, that I can find this green bag for you, because I have been seeing this bag at every TJ Maxx I go to, but I don't pick it up because I already have the green, so. Um, I'm here for you, girl. All right, y'all. So I got lucky. I found one bag for one of the girlfriends. So one of the girlfriends, she live in Houston. Hey, girl. Hey, I just sent her a uh, trying to talk to y'all in the communities. Girl, it's hectic. Okay. 
um so this is the bag she wanted I'm trying to make sure i got her the best one and i'm gonna ship this bag off to her so one of the there's another girlfriend she wants a green so i keep seeing i saw the green hair yesterday it's gone when i tell you there's no color so the lady at the um register was like well what i don't know what's going on with these bags i keep seeing ladies come in here saying that some girl from youtube told them to to come get the bag and girl i bust out laughing i said yeah the same girl told me to come too i watch her videos <laughs> hey girlfriends who been coming to tj maxx because g sent y'all <laughs> But, okay, I'm about to go to another TJ Maxx. It's a little far out of my way, but I'm still going to drive there because I'm already in the rain. I'm already out. And if we're being honest, the way I wanted that pink bag and somebody got it for me, I'm going to, I want to pay it forward. But also, this reminds me of the time that maybe like two or three years ago, I was on a hunt for this black, matte black Starbucks cup. This was before Starbucks cups was like just as, you could just walk in and get them. So common now. When I wanted this cup, y'all, this cup was like the hottest cup on the block. You could not find this cup. And I remember kind of like giving up on it. And I was having a bad day one day, girl. I went to check my P.O. box and one of the girlfriends sent me that cup, y'all. I sat in my car and cried. Because I was having a bad day and that cup just made me so happy. The fact that somebody went out their way to buy this cup for me. <laughs> so I'm paying it forward, girlfriend. The girlfriend who live in Dallas, you say you want the... I believe your name is like Lux Mama. Girl, you know who I'm talking about. I'm on my way to get your bag. I'm on the hunt for the bag, girl. I'm crossing fingers that I can get this bag because I want you to have the bag, okay? Okay, y'all, so I was unsuccessful. So now I'm, I feel so bad. I'm trying to see what other store I can go to because I was not successful at finding this bag for one of the girlfriends. But I met a girlfriend in TJ Maxx. <laughs> hey, girl, hey. Y'all, I'm so embarrassing. So she stopped me. She was like, I'm gonna stop you because I know you and y'all she looks so cute so we just literally I was talking to this woman all of two seconds and I was like looking at her I said where you going I said oh lord that's two nosy journey you do not know this woman she said it's okay I know that's a part of your personality <laughs> that is so embarrassing and then girl I, I, she said she was on her way home I was like where you live I said journey get out get out okay you're embarrassing us Girl, I be meeting y'all, and then I feel like y'all be asking me questions. What y'all don't know is I am so nosy. I want to know why she was all dressed up and where she was going. She said she came from a funeral and she was eating, and she was on her way home. I said, girl, that's too nosy. Let me get out of here, asking this woman all her damn business. So I wasn't successful at finding this green bag for the girlfriend, and I feel horrible. But at least I found one of them. So I'm about to text her and tell her that I was not successful at finding the bag. But I'm trying to see before I tell her, do it, is there any other TJ Maxx I could go to? Y'all would not believe what time it is. It is currently 1.19 a.m. And I am just now finished recording a video. Girl, y'all can probably hear my computer and everything. I did two videos today. It took a very long time because both of the videos were styling videos and I usually don't. Y'all, I know the lighting probably sucks, but I usually don't. Let me move my computer so y'all don't hear this. Not, girl, she's working overtime, okay? She's she, she's ready to go to sleep. Um, I usually don't like to record styling videos in the same day because when it comes to styling videos, I like to take my time. But I recorded two videos today because this week I really want to take it easy. So I did all of my work in one day. So this upcoming week I could just kind of like pour into myself. I could focus on like my wellness. Um, This week I want to do a lot of workout things and stuff like that. But if I had to like record during the week and something, it'll just be a lot. So I did all of my work today. Today is Saturday, y'all. I didn't have no plans. So I just been recording, girl. I started recording at 5 p.m. It is 1.21 a.m. So, so I'm about to clean up my apartment because it's a mess. The fact that I've been recording all day, there's makeup and clothes everywhere. So I'm about to clean up. Y'all, I'm tired, okay? But we got this. We got this. Y'all, it is 2.38 a.m. And I'm up in here washing dishes because I cannot go to sleep in a dirty apartment. A dirty house, I just cannot do. I do not like waking up to dirt, y'all. I can't. Hey girlfriends, happy Tuesday. Today is Tuesday, child. 
I woke up, y'all. I thought it was Friday. I watched my last vlog. I told y'all I, well, I messed up thinking that the day was Friday, but it was a really, I don't know why I always think it's Friday. Every day feel like a Friday to me. All right, so I need to end out this vlog because if we've been honest, y'all, this vlog is just going on and on and on and on and on. I don't know what kind of footage y'all got, y'all. I just literally just pick up this memory card anytime I want to vlog and just vlog. So I feel like I need to end this so I can properly, properly start a new vlog but right now i'm on my way i got on workout clothes child that's this that's the vibe okay so i'm about to go for a walk because i want to walk outside today because it's really beautiful and y'all know i love a good outside walk so i'm going to literally go walk and from my walk i'm going to go straight to the gym um last night i did yoga lattes and y'all it's yoga and pilates mixed together and i woke up this morning and my abs are on fire okay they have another class tomorrow i'm going okay y'all know this year is mission get g some abs yeah we on it um but yeah girl y'all my stomach is like burning like even if i just like right oh this hurts right here everything is just sore so i was like oh my god i like this feeling we're going back tomorrow, girl. So I'm on my way to the my P.O. box to see if the bag is there. And last night, girl, I'm scrolling on Anthropology and they have these new beaded bags. Oh my God, I'm just trying not to buy it. I want it in green. And I was thinking about getting it in pink too. Oh, it's just so good, but I'm like, Jernica, you don't need to buy another bag, sis. Okay, y'all, it says I have one package. Let's cross fingers that this is the bag. All right, y'all, so I got the package. I don't know if it's the bag. My heart says it's the bag because, y'all, it's kind of light. Oh, I don't want to get my whole tie and it's not the bag. Oh, my God. I don't know, y'all. I feel so nervous. Oh, my God. I feel like I have anxiety. I don't think... I think it's the bag because it's not wrapped in, like, PR. So, I know this is not, like, a PR package, but maybe one of y'all sent me something. <gasps> to you <gasps> oh my god wait wait girl this just made my day a 30 dollar bag just made my day <gasps> oh my god y'all it's so beautiful <gasps> if you got this bad girlfriend shout out to you because oh my god <gasps> yo it's so pretty the color it is gorgeous i love the fact that it's like this blush my Girl, I love the girlfriends, okay? One thing about the girlfriends, y'all got my back. I went all over New Orleans looking for this bag and could not find it. This color is so pretty. A lot of girlfriends were saying it's like a blush pink. It is blush, but it can, oh my God, it, y'all. Oh my God. I'm so, girl, when I tell you appreciative, thank you so, 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 so much. Like, wow. She literally, the day that I posted, I was looking for the bag, y'all, she literally was like, yeah, I just dropped it off to the um, post office. And in my head, I'm like, am I being scammed? Y'all, she really sent the bag. Wow. I'm lost for words, y'all. Oh, my God. It's so pretty. <gasps> this has made my day. Okay, y'all. I'm about to go. My grandma just called me. I was on my way to the gym. But she was like, do you want to go walk? So, we're about to go walk. y'all i don't want y'all to see me because i look a mess i'm still in my pajamas <laughs> um i'm drinking my morning tea and i'm sitting here watching this video because girl there's a partnership in this video and i like to watch my videos on tv before i um make them public girl why somehow all of the music in this video it moved so none of the music is lined up to where it's supposed to be girl i already sent the video to a brand so now i have to I'm gonna just wait for them to approve it or deny it and then I'll just tell them that all of the, you know, errors has been corrected. But 
Oh, that's an ugly little screenshot of me. But <laughs> hopefully by the time you guys are watching this video, you already watched this one. All right, y'all. So I'm on my way out the door. Another day, another workout look. So I have on this pink top from Target, some biker shorts from Target, and this little cover-up windbreaker jacket because they have like a light breeze out but i don't want to be too hot and i'm gonna just put on my workout sneakers i actually want to find workout socks i want like a pack of nudes and neutrals because when i wear lighter workout clothes the black too harsh so uh that's all i got for y'all i'm gonna just put on my workout bag i'm about to fill up my water cup and i see y'all outside i also want to um stop to Oh, let me turn y'all around. I also need to change my battery. Let me do that while I'm thinking about it. Um, I also want to go to Victoria's Secret because I have a coupon and I want to use it on a pair of pajamas. Mm, I don't care what nobody got to say. If I got a coupon, I want to use it. It's like a $40 coupon, so I want to buy some pajamas. And I also need to do my hair. So today I was, I'm going live today, girl. I'm going live today at 6 p.m. Um, I need to dye my hair, so... It's been a minute since I dyed my unit. That's why I'm keep, I keep wearing it in a ponytail. So I need to dye this unit because it's turning back. Y'all can't see it, but it's turning back to its natural color and I don't like it. So I need to put a fresh jet black dye on it. And I was supposed to record today. Content. I like to record on Wednesdays to get it like out, but girl, out the way. But I don't think I'm going to do it because I really want to wear this unit in the next video. So... Maybe when I come back, we'll go ahead and dye this unit to get that out of the way and see what I can do today to be productive. So let's get out of the house. Y'all, I just realized I haven't talked to y'all all day. I'm with my grandma at Trader Joe's. These are so pretty, but I feel like roses are so high maintenance. But these will look so good in my apartment. Alright y'all, so I'm at Victoria's Secret, treating myself to some more PJs. Now, they literally have all of the That's ones so I awesome. wanted. Mm, oh, I hope not, let's see. No, these are the longer ones. I want this color right here. Let's see if they have, oh they do have it in large. This color is so cute, it's like a pink with like a burgundy piping. So I'm gonna get these. Oh, these are cute, but these are shorts. I'm not really a shorts type of girl when it comes to PJs. I wanted these. These are cute. Oh my God, those are so cute. Are those shorts? Mm -hmm. I like these because they have hearts, but I don't want shorts. These are so pretty. These are, are these silk or satin? Let's see the price that's gonna tell me. These are silk. If they have these in a large, I'm definitely gonna get them because they are, oh, they have it in a large. Oh, these pants are huge, child. Uh-uh. I like the stripes, so let's get it in a large. If they have them in a large, I'm gonna get them because these are so cute with the hearts. Oh, these are cute too. Do they have them in large? I guess it's a good thing they don't have them in large because I don't need. Oh, oh, they do have them in large. Okay, I have to get these too, y'all. Oh my god, hold on, no. I need to make a decision because I don't need both pairs. I'm about to be responsible. Out of these and these, I like these because I don't know if y'all can see it. These have like little pink polka dots and they're gray. Okay, I'm gonna get these. Thank you. Here you go. You're welcome. Have, have a great day. day. You too. Secure the goods. Girl, you never have nothing to say. Don't let her guilt you into talking to her. Girl, I'm about to mute you because I can talk to my blog. I don't have time for negativity. Hold on. Mute. Let me turn them down. Hey, girl, hey. I am back home. Mm-hmm. Let's do a little haul. We're gonna start off with Trader Joe's. I got, oh, well, not Trader Joe's. Let's start off. What's a little chaotic? I had to stop to get Stephanie's computer because I'm going live at six. It is two o'clock. So we're gonna sit there right there. From Trader Joe's, I got sourdough bread. This is the best sourdough bread ever. I like to make toast and I like to make grilled cheese. This week, I definitely wanna do grilled cheese. So I got eggs. I think y'all already saw me in Trader Joe's pick half of this stuff up. I got basil. So there's this TikTok pasta that I keep seeing and I really want to make it, y'all. So I got these pasta noodles. 
Mm-hmm. I got the lobster bisque from Trader Joe's. If you never had this, girl, it's so good. You have to dress it up just a little, but it's so good. And this is going to be basically like the pasta sauce. And I got fresh basil to go into the pasta because I'm obsessed with basil. And I got vegan butter because I switched from regular butter to vegan butter. I got whole wheat pasta noodles. I got onion salt, my favorite onion salt. And I got two shots of vinegar. I like to keep the vinegar. Two shots of ginger. I like to keep these in my refrigerator at all times. I went to the store with my grandma, the grocery store, and I got a chopped salad kit. I got this seasoning because I love this seasoning, y'all, on like different meats. Hold on, let me focus, girl. Y'all, this is so good on like chicken and fish. I got some of these chips. These are my favorite chips. I believe you can only buy them in New Orleans, and I love this kind, so I'm gonna use it or eat these tonight on live. I got my weekly bunch of flowers, and I get baby breaths to put in different places, like in the kitchen, because these are dead. So, I got baby breaths. Now, y'all know I'm a tea girl. Look at my tea thing. It's empty. My tea little thing is usually full. And I'm like, oh no, this is unacceptable. So, I got some tea. So, from Whole Foods, I got organic green tea this green tea y'all is very very strong but it's so so good so i also picked up a relaxing chamomile because i do drink tea at nighttime but i try to do like decaf tea so this is the one that i picked up for like a nighttime sleepy time tea and i picked up an everyday detox tea because lately y'all i have been enjoying everyday detox tea sometimes i'll do it in the morning or whatever because i'm not really a coffee girl lately i have been having like a, a little taste for coffee but when it comes to tea baby i love tea so i got the uh, come on why am i not focusing everyday detox tea which is so so good y'all i got two of the bubbly rose kombucha because i enjoy these but y'all know my favorite one is the pineapple belly which i have a whole girl when i say my refrigerator is stocked with this right now i have like 10 of these in a the fridge because they was on sale at target so screenshot this because sis you need to add this into your life okay so hopefully y'all can hear my sisters because we on the phone hold on let's tell them to be quiet i'm talking to my blogs um, I can hear y'all while I'm talking to my blog. Could y'all like pipe down just a little? We're having the fun fun. No, I need y'all to be quiet while I talk to my people. I thought y'all hung up on me. <laughs> I will see you guys later when I go live. Hopefully, all of the girls who are watching this. You made it to a live. If you never watched one of my lives, you are missing out on the Kiki. Okay, where, where, where do you live? Under a rock? Tune in, babes. I'm outside in an AMG. Right outside. TT. Two turn, baby girl. I'm all set up to go live, y'all. It's way later. It is 5.56. I have four minutes. Y'all, why am I nervous? Why am I nervous? I, I, I'm nervous. And I don't know if I'm be, it's because I'm a little, my energy just had an energy shift because I was going back and forth with a brand for a sponsored video. And child, they wanted me to take half of everything out of the video. And I'm just like, this is why I personally don't, of course we love getting a coin, but sponsored content, I feel like brands are just, they want their hand too much in the creative part to where it takes away from the creator actually adding their own personality and stuff to it. And the stuff, God, I feel like I've been fighting all day to keep certain things in this video. And I'm just like, if you guys realize on my channel, I haven't had a sponsored video y'all since last year. I took a break from sponsored content because it was just back and forth all of the time. And I just felt, it was just adding stress to me. And I'm like, you know what? Let's take a break from sponsored content. So I took a break from sponsored content and I say 2024, I will come back to sponsored content. This is my first video back and I'm just like, But I, I'm thankful, I'm grateful, thank God for, you know, sponsored videos that brands want to work with me. But girl, last year I said no so much and the same brands that I would say no to, now they're coming back around. And my, in my head I'm like, I'm not going to compromise myself and my creativity. Just sending me a creative brief, but using another creator's video and wanting me to recreate another creator's video is wild to me. It's just wild and I'm just not doing it.
but anyways that was my little debacle that i just went through and i'm just like trying to calm down so i made certain changes a lot of the changes y'all i was fighting for okay i'm like i cannot remove this okay if y'all need to we need to start from scratch we can start from scratch but i'm not removing x y and z and i'm happy i stood up for myself because at the end of the day we aligned on whatever but it annoyed me so i'm about to go live and i'm nervous I'm never nervous when I go live, but for some reason I got a little something there. All right, y'all, so I just got off live. I'm about to run downstairs to the, to the gym to do, why is my camera doing this? Do a little workout. Um, But before I do that, I always, anytime I go live, I always watch it on TV because half of the time, y'all, I don't know what I said. I'm like, okay, y'all need to leave this up. So basically it's like, I need to review to see if this video should go up before other people watch it. Y'all, this is the pasta. Oh my God, y'all, this pasta is so good, okay? It's the fresh basil with the light hint of lobster sauce. Oh my God, y'all, it is so good. So in the next vlog, we gotta cook this. Hey girl, hey, happy Wednesday. So y'all, I know I've been saying this all vlog, but I'm about to let y'all go because I've been dragging y'all around in my pocket all month, okay? And enough is enough, I gotta let y'all go. But girl, I just finished editing the vlog that you guys are watching right now. I was like, well, damn. I did not realize how much February wore you out. It was like, girl, left and right. February was, girl, now, we wasn't tussling because it looked like I wasn't fighting back. She was wearing me out, okay? I was like, well, get up, G. Fight back, swing, do something, okay? Oh my God, y'all, February dragged me. I needed 14 days of love. I did not realize how much February was whooping me until I started editing this vlog. I'm ready for her to go. Go on, girl, go. Where is your scooter? Get out of here. Oh, February, girl, I don't want no more. Just leave me alone, go. I'm ready for the new month, girl, because February, I was like, well, girl, I forgot all about this. Editing this vlog triggered me. The video was like three hours long. Right now, we at 45 minutes. I had to edit so much. I was like, Jeremy, because these people don't want to hear all this. Let it go, sis. So a lot of stuff, y'all, I let out. I cut out because, child, we just want to go, go on. We don't, we don't want no more smoke. But I picked up the camera because I'm excited, y'all. So y'all know I told y'all I took a break from sponsored content. In 2024, I said I would pick back up doing sponsored content. Looking back now, I, I didn't feel this way last year, but when I was quitting my job, I was like, I already was stressed and trying to do sponsored content. I felt like I was in such a weird space with creating. And I was like, you know what? If you're going to do this full time, you need to get back to having fun with it. Take off the pressure and just have fun. Create what you want to create and just fall in love with it again. And it took for me to step back from a lot of things. I stepped back from doing sponsored content. So there was no one telling me what I had to create or, hey, can you take this out or could you do this? It was all me. And I'm at a point now where I love creating again. I'm having fun with it. I do not put pressure on myself. I just have fun and upload i create what i want to create but i also create what you guys want to see but there has to be a mix i feel like i don't want to just create what everybody want to see like i just did the video on the dupes and it's it, it's doing well it's like at 115k now but i'm not about to keep putting out dupe videos just because that went well no that was like okay that worked then i want to continue to create what i want so i said all this to say this year i'm back doing sponsor content and the first one was a little tug of war but at the end it was all good this morning i um woke up to quite a few emails y'all one thing about it last year when i was declining declining all of these you know sponsorships and offers child when i sit down and i realized how much money i was walking away from i said well lord could we just take one sponsorship and my spirit just kept saying no stay firm and keep doing what you're doing Looking back now, I can say I'm so happy I took a break from sponsor content because like I said, I'm back having fun with creating. I don't put pressure. I just do me. I don't worry about if it's perfect. I just create from an authentic place and I'm just having fun. It's not like, okay, is this video going to get a lot of views? I'm just genuinely having fun again. So now that I'm having fun again, it's crazy how the same people that I was declining, I did it in a very professional way. Anytime you decline a brand, you always want to do it in a professional way because you don't know if you're going to want to work with them in the future. Yeah, all of the people that I declined, they coming back around and they coming back around heavy, okay? 
and I appreciate it, okay? Another thing is, when I started to walk away from brands, when we couldn't align, the same brands, the energy, the tone in these emails, they're different. I love that for me. So I get an email this morning from a brand and I'm just like, my mouth hit the floor. I was like, oh my God, I have been waiting for y'all at the door, okay? I have been doing the work because I knew y'all was gonna come and now that y'all over here and y'all have, uh, I'm ready, okay? I am ready. I'm so excited, y'all. I can't really tell y'all too much because I ain't signed no contracts. So once the contract is signed, then we can talk more, but I am excited, okay? Because when you wait, okay? And you don't live in a scarcity mindset, like, oh my God, I have to take everything that comes my way because what if it doesn't come? When you wait for what's for you, oh girl, I told y'all God say bigger in 2024, bigger. Yeah, I'm so excited. I am so excited. So I have a meeting tomorrow with this uh, brand and I just, I'm excited. I'm very excited. And I can't wait to show y'all what's going on because I'm excited for this. This is fun, okay? This is what I want. When I work with a brand, I want to feel like this, like, oh my God, this is so fun. Because I could literally be myself and the content, it mixes organically with my life and what I got going on anyway. So, <gasps> So 2024, when it comes to creating, we're having fun. We're not putting pressure on ourselves. We're not comparing ourselves to other people. What's for them is for them. What is for you is for you. What is for me is for me, okay? We ain't worrying about nothing, okay? Another thing I was thinking about, I was like, I'm so happy that when all of these brands were coming to work with me earlier on, like I'm talking about like way earlier on, like COVID, a lot of the brands, yeah, they're big names, but I was like, that's not the way I wanna go. So I think it's very important to work with brands who align with you now or who align with where you wanna be. Because the brands that was reaching out now, Back then, I was like, no, this is the type of companies that I want to work with. And then I just kept saying no, no, no to all of the other brands who just didn't align with my name or my brand or what I was doing. And now I get to work with the people who I've been wanting to work with. So this is exciting, okay? So I said all of that to say, it's okay to say no, girl, and wait for what's for you, okay? Mm-hmm. So I was at Target a few days ago and I got a new air fryer because it was on sale. Baby, when I tell y'all I have been air frying everything, I'm cooking my lunch so when I come back from the gym, I can have food ready. So that is fish and I'm going to have vegetables. How boring, but it is what it is. package from mango now if you are not keeping up with me on youtube you should especially in the communities because as soon as i see something that's on sale or something that i'm about to buy i let y'all know first before i tell anybody else okay so when i was in new york last year yeah i saw these bags i was just in mango in soho and i saw these bags and i was like oh my god this is so cute i I'm really into shoulder bags right now. So I was like, this is so cute. And oh, the packaging is really nice. This would be really good in my handbag collection. It's different. It doesn't have logos. It's just a regular bag. I did not want to pay $139 for these bags. And they were on sale. I saw them on sale a couple days ago. Oh my God, it's so pretty. They're on sale for $40. If they're still available, I'm going to link them below. So they're these genuine leather and pony hair bags. Look how gorgeous this bag is. The color is so vibrant, oh my God. And purple is my favorite color. How amazing is this? Now, and it comes with a strap like this. So, so pretty y'all. Just imagine this in the summertime with a cute little dress. I feel like these type of bags are just like the perfect little touch to a look especially if you're like a shoulder bag girl y'all know i'm in my shoulder bag era i think they just look so dainty and so cute but this color everything so i got it in purple oh i can't wait to style her in a, um, a styling video every time i get new pieces i always want to make a styling video <laughs> so that means y'all could be expecting a styling video coming soon <gasps> oh my god oh my god ladies and gentlemen her <gasps> Oh my god y'all can't really tell but it's the same oh my god it's so so smooth i thought it would have like that leather smell it doesn't 
I don't know if y'all can see the details. The pony hair is everything. This color is everything. So cute. And it also comes with a leather shoulder strap. I'm going to link both of them down below if they are still available. You cannot beat this for uh, $40. So, yeah. So, for this bag, I end up cutting the leather strap off. And I like it better with this little chain strap that I picked up from Amazon. I feel like it's way more dainty and cute. I'm not mad at the mixed metals. I actually like this. So, I feel like this is definitely more of my speed. This is definitely more of my speed. It's so dainty and so cute. Don't get me wrong. This, it's okay, this strap. But I like it better with this. I feel like it's more of my speed. And I know for a fact I'll wear it more like this. And I can also wear it as a clutch if I want. But I love this. Y'all could hear the dishwasher in the back. But come on now. Tell me this don't look better. It is so stinking cute. Everything about it is so cute. I love the aged gold um, hardware on the strap. The chain strap. And it just looks so dainty and cute. I love this way better. I'm going to link this chain strap below. Like, what? I'm obsessed with this bag. Girl, it is so good. It looks so luxurious. Baby, look at this color. Are you seeing this? So, I was thinking about just switching. Anytime I want to wear each bag, just switch a chain out. This chain was $10 from Amazon, so I just ordered one for the green. So, I don't have to always switch it out. But, babes, you, you, you get the vibes. It's so good. And what I love about this purple, it's definitely reminded me of like that Tom Ford Gucci era. This is definitely the purple that he used to use. Oh, it's so good. So it is later in the night and I just finished doing my nails. Can y'all believe I have, they're not white, but they are pinky white. They look white, but they have like a hint of pink. So I did that. Um, the more I do my nails, I do get a little better. And yeah, so I just poured up a glass of kombucha. And right now I am in bed watching the Wendy Williams documentary. And when I tell y'all, I have been crying, girl off and on every five seconds that documentary is extremely sad i don't care what nobody said i don't wish that's that on anyone i believe she has dementia um yeah i don't wish that on anybody the doc documentary is really really sad and girl it's just like watching this i'm like how is this okay like how is this being televised like it's crazy but um i did skincare i went to yoga lotties i'm gonna get up in the morning and go to a spin class and yeah that's all i have for this vlog i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did go ahead give it a big thumbs up like share comment subscribe anything i could link below i'm sure it's linked below now this polish is a new polish i tried y'all i'm not mad at this i'm not mad at all at this polish lately i've been in the mood for like pink polish but not like neon pink and i would recommend this polish i'm actually in love with it it's really pretty i love the fact that it's not pink pink and it, it looks white so it messes with my mind and make me feel like i got white nails when i'm actually trying something new oh my god this is so good drinking kombucha in a wine glass is a top tier experience it makes you feel like you're drinking wine but you're not it's so good Bye, girl.